Okay, hi guys. Okay, so let's do it. Let's do the um, 2019 to be read list that I want them to. And I want to do this experiment because I've seen other people um, do this sometimes where they tell you what, when and what they're going to read and then you guys can come to my Facebook, you can read the same books as I'm reading that month and uh, you know make spoiler comments and, and comments about what you thought about the book so you get a bit of a nice conversation going and like a little book club of our own. Okay so uh, with no further ado I will tell you, uh, I obviously need to bring my laptop because I can't remember because I've done one book a month and I can't have 12 books in my head uh, with authors, it's not gonna happen so I thought I'll bring my book, laptop and I'll read it to you. Okay so let's get started. So. Uh, for January, obviously, I've already read um, Son of Chaos by Lexi C. Foss, and if you haven't already checked out that video that I did, uh, a review of that book, then then let's he head there, that way. Uh, if you want to tell me what you thought about it, if you read it, let me know, section below in the comments or in on my Facebook. I will probably send out a thread just to ask as well uh, about it. Uh, February, just finished, just made the... Um, Live Fay or Die Trying by uh, Jenna uh, Wolfhart. So uh, if you have read that one now for January, for February as well, then let me know and let me know what you think. And that one I have read. So January, February already sort of done. Um, so let's and and oh no, I've also done March. I'm too far ahead on my schedule. So uh, my March pick was. Uh, Winds of Change by uh, Angela Sanders. Sorry guys, you can also check that one out already. Um, but still, you can let me know what you think. Um, and then we'll, we'll, I will probably... Um, Claire Marta has um, Frostbite, which she's told me it's probably something I was going to like. So I'm reading that just now. So if you do want to cash out with me for February, um, then that one would probably be it. And then I've um, also uh, bought to my Kindle um, uh, Robin Hobbs uh, something ship. The one with the sh I'll have I'll come back to you with that one. But um, uh, ship of something something. Uh, I will, I'm going into my Goodreads here now because on Goodreads I have the other books as well that. I wanted to read but didn't make it on this list because I don't want to promise that I will read them but I do want to read them uh, so I have there for let's see like the cruel prince with um, Holly Black and the Wicked King I would like to read as well but let's see if I get to that um, anytime soon so Ship of Magic Ship of Magic with Hobbin, uh, Rob, Robin Hobb I'm gonna because um, over it on the channel with um, what Cass read which is uh, a very nice lady, I think. I've watched a lot of uh, re book reviews, um, you, um, bloggers, but for some reason I tend to like um, what Cass read. So I, um, she's, um, she's very warm and nice and she sort of likes the books that I like, I think. So we have a lot of in common there. So uh, with the fantasy and the... Um, she's more fantasy fantasy as well, which I do like as well. I would like to read more epic fantasy and get into that as well. It's her favourite author so I so I check, check it out. So those I will be reading anyway. So April, let's go on to April. Joel uh, Crawford um, has written Michael's Passion and so I'm gonna do that one in April. Uh, I'm gonna do um, for May read, I'm gonna do Doc Promise by Nikki Landis. La, da, da, June and I'm really looking forward to this one for June it's Black Prism by Brent Weeks and I've heard a lot of nice things about this one this one is another one I've heard from over what um, what Cass read so um, check out her video as well and what she thought about this book but yeah she's hyped it up for me and I think I'm really really gonna enjoy this one so um, the Black Prism from Brent Weeks so July uh, Wiccan's War by Heather Marie Adkins, also looking forward to that one. Uh, I believe that's going to be a sort of um, young, maybe young adult, sort of paranormal, um, black versus white magic sort of um, story. So yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to that one as well. So um, that's Wiccan War for July. August, 
uh, Demons and Deceptions by uh, Katarina Martinez and Tansy, uh, Tansy Morgan. So that as well I'm lo really looking forward to. It looks awesome on the cover. Um, I believe this one probably will be a bit more of an urban sort of detective, sort of crimey, sort of um, twisty book. So yeah, that one is going to go for August. September, if you want to read with me, uh, The Forever Girl by Rebecca Hamilton. A uh, young adult spell sort of witchy sort of book as well. So I think I'm going to be enjoying that. Uh, October I'm going to be go a bit darker, the same as probably the weather will go a bit darker, although here in Gibraltar um, it tends to still be summery weather. But anyway, it turns a bit darker and I'm going to do um, Rune Awakening by uh, Genevira black i hope i'm telling that name correctly so that's a bit more of a necromancer sort of spiritual dark magic maybe or maybe i'll be wrong let's see but that's what i think it's gonna be so that one i'm looking forward to do uh, in october november i'm gonna try another robin hobb book again um this one in the series of the assassin's apprentice so again because this was recommended by read by cass and she swears by this uh, series as well that it's going to be really good and uh, I'm really looking forward um, to this and I, I don't know but I do get the feel that it's sort of going to be a bit sort of Game of Thronesy, maybe not so gruesome as Game of Thrones but um, that sort of royal castle sort of sorcery and and um, questy sort of sorcery sort of book so yeah I'm really looking forward to that one and then in December, I've heard a lot about the Brooks Sky series. So, um, Sky Brooks, sorry. Um, so, Moon Tortured by Mackenzie uh, Hunter. Um, so, this is a lot of review around this book on Amazon. A lot of people are speaking on Facebook about this book. Um, so, it's it's a wolf packy sort of um, paranormal romance or. Also, and I think it's gonna be like I don't know vampires and shape shifting and things like that. So, um, super good. So those are the ones I'm hoping I will get through this year. Obviously, I've had a lot going on, um, and the ones that I hope I will come to as well is on my Goodread account. So if you go to my Goodread account, Trees Caruana or TM Caruana, I um, have there as well a few more books, more Robin Hobbs. As I said, Holy Black, um, and what else did I have there? Yeah, so I had, yeah, Lynn, uh, Scott Lynch, The Gentleman Bastard Sequence, The Lies of Locamora. Um, I also had uh, there Brandon Sanderson's The Way of Kings, which also have been quite debated. Oh yeah, the Sebastian de Castel has The Traitor's Blade. So yeah, a lot of nice books that I'm trying to get through this year. So um, if you read it with me or if you read it on the side or if you've already read them, uh, please give me a comment in the section below telling me what you thought about them, um, how you thought they could, you know, uh, maybe be better, what parts you did like more than others so that I get some inspiration and in knowing what you guys like as well for when I'm writing. And um, yeah, subscribe, connect, read. And I see you later. Thank you very much. Bye.